expectancy uh, the last few I don't ever really think that way. I don't. I'm just looking if we're playing well. Sometimes you play well and they, they still score anyway. And uh, really, I just uh, I was proud of our guys. And the young guys got to get in there and play. And just three plays, we just had a uh, three bus and uh, he had the wheel route and then uh, the post route touchdown to seven. And then the last play there on fourth and goal. Uh, another bust, and uh, those are plays that you you you, you, you get kind of uh, disgruntled about. But otherwise, our guys, man, I thought they responded. They came out with the right focus and intensity. Uh, you know, set the tempo right away. Played outstanding. The first half came back out and really got after him in the third quarter. Uh, loved how they played and um, had a great mindset. And uh, there, there'll be some great teaching um, opportunity uh, with the, the last few drives of this game. But I uh, thought our guys really um, uh, played well and gave us a chance to win. You keep talking about how this group can get better. Did they do that today, or how are they getting better? Going uh, again, I just I look at it just one game at a time, and I, I thought they played really well um, uh, for the most part today. So I'm sure there will be plays that – you know, every game's that way where you can say, oh, we need to do this better, that better. You learn from things. But uh, to me, you got better because you got the 6-0. and And uh, you, you beat a real quality opponent, a, a team that we felt would be a tough out going in, and they certainly were. Uh, you get up on them 28 nothing. you're doing a lot really, really well. And, um, and I think that starts with their preparation and their focus and their respect for the game and the intensity. Uh, again, coming out of halftime uh, with a 14 nothing. again, having the right mindset. Okay, let's start over. Uh, nothing that's uh, less important than the score at halftime. And our guys had that kind of mindset. And again, knew that Wake Forest would not just go away. And uh, uh, they were very content with continuing to try to you know make it a ball game all the way to the end and good for them. And uh, so uh, it's, again, real proud of our guys. And again, we got a, we got a short turnaround this week and uh, playing in a, a, a Syracuse team that uh, could throw the ball all over the lot and has had ultra success on offense and then uh, not even were close to, to the kind of defense they were uh, last year. They are much, much improved and playing very disciplined in what they're doing and had a chance to beat both LSU and NC State. And uh, being at their place, um, you know, expect to get their best shot. I think Steve Ishmael maybe is a leading receiver in the country. And uh, that quarterback is a handful, man, can really, uh, you know, wing it around. And uh, he's got a great complement of skill players and a really good uh, system.